How to split text into two different columns in Canva. Hey everyone, welcome. I hope you're all doing great. In this video, I'll show you step by step how to do so. It is actually very easy and simple to do, and there are two different ways to do so as well. So I'm just going to show you both. Now, first, I'm just going to begin by creating a new design. And one of the methods you would actually have to or need to have a solid, solid color background. Otherwise, it's not going to really work well. Uh, unless you're fine with showing an actual table like for the columns. But other than that, we can just go and click on create a design and we can just get started. So now that we have a design, it doesn't really matter the size for it. Uh, the first method, which is the easier one, yet a little bit complicated to perfect because you want to ensure you have the proper distance between them and such, is actually just going and adding a box of text on the left side and on the right side and you would actually have a proper two different columns for text so for example we have this one we can just go ahead and move it a little bit to the top to the left side and we can just go ahead and add some dummy text let me just go ahead and grab some dummy text so it actually looks a little bit uh, realistic so i added some dummy text and as you can see it just went crazy so in that case you would want to just go ahead and uh Reduce the font size, so we can just go in and actually make it a little bit uh, not that small. We can just make it uh, 150, maybe. I'm not sure. No, let's test 90. Okay, uh, maybe 50. Okay, that si seems you know reasonable. So once you add the first one, and yet now you obviously want to add the second one. So in that case, you just want to duplicate this. So you just go in and right click on it, duplicate it, and you just want to try to move it so that it is, um, you know, the same distance away from the actual middle section. And you obviously would want to replace the text with another uh, bit of text. And if you want to start moving them together, uh, you can also do so by grouping them. You can just go in and highlight both and group them. And this way you can actually move them as if they are one item. So, uh, this is the first method. Like I said, it's not perfect, but uh, it does work if you're really dedicated with trying to find the middle. But if you wanted to make it easier for yourself, uh, you can just go ahead and do slash, uh, which is just going to open up this command center, and we can just go ahead and search for a table. Uh, and if we just open up table, you would want to have two different rows or, you know, columns. Uh, and then we can just go ahead and move them upwards a little bit and we can just start adding the text that we want in the columns so um, both are going to have different text obviously but you can just go ahead and try to um, you know make them the same size same distance this is a, a little bit better because you can actually you know uh, ensure that both of them are exactly in the middle and not only that but you can actually go ahead and uh, increase the table spacing between them as you can see, uh, and not only that, but you can also change the color of the actual table so that it does not have uh, the background color of the background. So we can make it invisible is what I'm trying to say, as you can see. So in this case, we can just go and paste that in and again, we can just go for 50. And same goes here. We can just go ahead and paste that in again and do 50. And actually, we can see that it looks a lot better and we can move it together. Um, and yeah, this is pretty much two different ways to split text into columns in Canva. Hopefully, you found this video to be informative. And thanks for watching.